Hi there. This is Alex from Essential Web Apps. And, in this video, we will learn about the wireframing technique in Figma. Wireframing of a website is the simplified visualization of the basic structure, or perhaps we may call it the skeleton of a website. But before we get into it, we make videos regularly. If you want to see videos like this, please hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon for notification. Wireframes of websites are something that give a clear picture regarding the usability. Styling is very important but at the beginning of a design, it can be a bit distracting. It can shift the focus from functionality to something fancy like colors or pictures. Because, wireframe is so simple, it keeps focus on the important issues like website functionality, usability, and user experience. There are considerably two levels of wireframing. 1. Low fidelity wireframing. And 2. High fidelity wireframing. In a low fidelity level, UI elements are presented with gray shapes, like rectangles, circles, or just simple lines. At a high fidelity level, the UI gets a little bit more details, like brand logo, actual text, texture or shadow, and so on so. In the case of text content, always try to use real content which will finally be on the main website, instead of lorem ipsum. By this, you can get a real perspective of the design. Let's talk about the best practice of wireframing. So, the first rule here is about the aesthetics, and that is to keep it simple. I mean, really simple. You should not use any color rather than white, black and gray. Use at most two fonts all over the design. And, of course, use a simple font like Roboto or Lato. Nothing fancy. Represent graphics and images with boxes. Wireframing is the stage where you consider screens. Wireframe all the versions of the design for different types of devices. Either for desktop, or mobile, or tablet. Also, you have to consider the orientations for the smaller devices like phones or tablets. You also have to keep in mind the context of the use of a particular device. If you want to see a video on, converting a desktop design into a mobile version, tell us in the comment section. In Figma, there is a ready template for you to work on your wireframing. You find the link in the description. It has all the basics elements that you need in a website, and you can start building right away. And at the end, whatever the technology or software you use, they're nothing better than a simple pen and paper. If you want to design a UI go traditional. Always start on a good old paper with a pencil. So, there you go. What's else you want to know about Figma? Let me know in the comment section. And if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And, I will see you in the next video.